attempt to mess with it, uh, turn like ripped Arthur's soul apart into five fragments, I think, and each one became just end of monstrosity. So they brought back the only being who's ever been able to stop Arthur, Mordred. So you play Mordred. So you're basically remaking the Knights of the Round Table from like some living knights and some undead knights. Half of them hated you, but they, you're the only thing that's ever been able to stop Arthur, so they're putting all, everything into you. <clears throat> Merlin, if you would. Is he still not burning? Oh, wait, no, he does have burning now. Okay. Oh, it just doesn't show the icon. It shows it up here, but it doesn't show him, like, on his... his thing. Okay. I survived Percival's Dolores stroke. Do you think he can kill me? Is it true that he stabbed you in the groin, too? You all know what that means, right? <laughs> <laughs> He's like, you think you can kill me? And Orchard's like, yo, dog, I heard your pee-pee don't work. <laughs> Like, what kind of back alleyway trash talk is that? <laughs> Your Highness. What did I just stumble into? Art. Backstab. Oh, man. No mercy We've got the angle now. You know, I didn't really think about backstabs. Can I... Let me teleport back here. I could do backstab magic missiles. Backstab times three. He has so much health, though. Illusion here, so that if he stops hitting the tank, he hits the illusion before he hits us. Give him the birds! Slap, block. We've gotten lucky. We've blocked three hits of his in a row. Mordred stunned and lost his turn. Your mind. Slow resist. Awaiting your command. Oh, it's not a backstab now because he turned around. Oh, I forgot to re-stealth him, dang it. Well, now he's backstabbing, I guess. What are we waiting for? You think the wasteland is a disease? Uh, it's not. I will no! the rot. Starting with you. The wasteland is the ash that must cover Avalon. And from the ashes, a new world will grow. Your Highness. Could be of some help, I suppose. The birds. What? Now, the question is, is he going to have more phases? Last time I fought him, he never he kept getting back up, but we didn't have the Excalibur then. Like, that was a story thing. Ah! There was one trap in the room and he walked into it. Dummy. Mind. You must be really desperate. You are laughable. Pain and suffering only makes us stronger. 
and your constant whining makes me even more furious. Keep it up. <laughs> oh no. No, leave Merlin alone. Do you need any wise words? That's it. Let's finish the monster. The grail is gone. The king should be dead. Fool, I am the grail. I am the light. I am the eternal. Do we just keep None slapping him? Stand in my way. Maybe Mordred had to do the death blow? There's the grail. Oh, wait, no, he's getting bigger. He's not dying. My vassals, they are desecrating the blessed halls of the grail. Oh, Kill God. Them. He's calling for backup. Do I have to kill you? Oh, you boy. All right. Uh, mind fog. You, hit one of your friends. Teleport. Your Highness. What are we waiting for? I'm gonna check something. Okay. All right, the crossbowman will go down. Slow him. <laughs> I love the birds just constantly swarming his face. There's the mind-controlled guy. Got a backstab. Burnout? Oh god, what does that do? What the script? Burnout, pull, slap, shadow lightning. Where'd you get all this AP? To move out of this red thing, I'm going to get hit with a slap. There's one there, one there, one there. If only I had my charge, but I already used it. to serve. Make up your mind. You must be really desperate. <laughs> um... Hmm. Want to make sure that those don't get back up. Put an illusion back there. A new world will rise from the ashes of the wasteland. This pagan land will die to give way to paradise. Which block? Nice. Wait, block again. Lost five armor though. Oh, he threw up on me. He's got death juice. And no one told me he had the death juice. I'm not even bleeding. Would you stop teasing him? All right, we're just using this to reposition without getting hit by an attack of opportunity. Your head is mine. Face this way. Do not... Do not end your turn facing that way. There. Ready. Awaiting your command. Try harder. 
Uh, in the end of King Arthur's Tale, Mordred, yeah. So the beginning of the game starts at the end of the old tale where Arthur and Mordred kill each other. Then something happens and like necromancy or something starts to bring back Arthur as a really twisted creature. The Lady of the Lake tries to stop it. Her interference plus the ritual ended up splitting him into five soul fragments and each one became a monstrosity. This is one of them. So they brought back the only thing that's ever been able to stop Arthur, which was Mordred. So you play Mordred and you're get, rounding up other knights, some that used to fight against you, some that used to fight for you, and you're trying to stop the monstrosity that the that Arthur has become, and also figure out how this happened in the first place. Ready to fight. No mercy for the wicked. What do you want? Oh my god. But wait, there's more! Alright, that one's not an issue. These two are an issue. Oh boy, he coming! Dang, boy! He thick! Hi, Errol. <laughs> Or sorcery. Uh, wait a minute. Your Highness, you must be really desperate. Okay, there's all of those. Mind fog on the guardian. Summon a distraction over here. Traps just in case. Ready. He went for one of the illusions. Ow! He went for an illusion. Hellburn. You must be really Hold on, I want to read his drain life move. What's that do? Summon vomit. Drain life. Deals damage on a cone and pulls units in. All damage dealt is restored to the Fisher King as vitality. Well, muck you. All right. He'll burn. This will take care of that. All right. I think. Actually, no. He will live. He needs Ready. another shot. All right. That should at least down all the ads. Let's throw heal on Merlin. I can only do that once per mission. None can stand in my way. <laughs> Try harder. 
It's not your time to go, my friend. Vomiting. Oh, God. The death juice. Shake it off. Shake it off! Using that just to reposition. Mm, face this way. Put stigma on him. I should have done this I earlier, could be honestly. Of some help, I suppose. All right, burn, burn, burn. Wait, he, wait, didn't I? Do I have another shot? What the heck? This guy doesn't usually have so much AP that he can uh, do that again. Sinner shall bleed. Try to put slow on him. Block, block, oh, Mordred's HP is almost gone. I'm not even bleeding. Don't taunt him, Mordred. You are bleeding. If I could help. I am here to serve. Glory for my Camelot. If this, if he gets up again, I'm gonna have to the chug a potion on Mordred. But the wound he tore into this world. Oh God, is that it? <sighs> Sweet. Still, two fragments of Arthur's soul have been destroyed. Let's see what the lady has to say about that. More means to our cause. You look like in a Sura IRL, please explain how. Um, when my parents rolled my character sheet, they rolled a 20 on charisma. <laughs> Some riches to take. Treasure lost and found. Relic jewelry. That's nice. Alright. Oh my goodness. Uh, someone gifted me a while I was leaving. Yep. <laughs> Cinematic! Cinematic! Lady of the Lake? Come to me, my champion. So I am your champion now? <laughs> I was like, what? You have destroyed the second shard of Arthur's torn soul. It's a reason to celebrate. Not to mention that a Christian king is dead. You should really know by now that I'm not taking sides. You don't believe me, do you? Would it convince you if I sent you against the demigods of the old faith? You are talking about the Shi, aren't you? I fought them in the Battle of Kamlan. Not those ones, my vengeful knight. This is the land of pure magic. So the Sili and the Unsili made themselves very comfortable here. They have become extremely powerful. Am I sensing bitterness here? Let's say I don't have as much power over their deep wood as anywhere else in Avalon. Can you open a gate for me? Or use your powers to take me there? No. You need a guide into that twilight realm. You must find the fairy knight who is neither human nor she. Let's say I enter the deep wood. Then what? Then you must cut and burn your way through that damned forest. Find Arthur's fragment. 
and destroy it. Dude, every this lady, it, it's kind of like when you're playing Witcher and you run into Yennefer. Every time you see her, she's like, hey, here's a chore list. <laughs> she's like, here's something to do. And it's just like, come on. Every time we meet, it's just, here's something to do. Ring of Renunciation grants the Mass Dispel skill. Uh, is that just what it sounds like? Like it just removes magical buffs or something? A tired and infuriated Sir Balin returned from Springdale. As it turned out, the curse was a mischievous Puka who moved into the village in the shape of a cat. Those troublesome fairies can be a blight on the unsuspecting peasants, but their fear of Icon, especially in the hands of a furious knight, helped to settle the problem. Thanks to Sir Balin, the little troublemaker left for now, but the respite of the villagers may be short-lived. Balin gains XP. He suffered an injury, but you get 100 building resources from the village. Okay. Well, Balin, let's get that treated. What, what happened? You got a brain concussion, Jesus. Any vitality damage will shock you for two turns. Oh God, okay. All right, she's still in hospice. I mean, that, when I say she's still in a hospice, it sounds like she's about to die. All right, Ector, what do you got? I guess. Other than slow hacks, I don't really love his other ones, but... Uh, Merlin. Merlin, Merlin, Merlin. There's a lot of pretty good choices here. Uh, dodge the first incoming melee hit each turn. That looks really nice. The buffs to the raven. I think I'll take the, the dodge. Oh, Merlin is the first person to unlock the third skill tree. What level is he? So it happens at 12. Um, okay. Falling Star does 130% weapon damage to every unit in 3x3, three three, causing knockback to people in the outer tiles. So it's a it's a meteor. Uh, Master of fire, more damage for fire, burning. Okay, Th that would this whole thing really good with the uh, the first skill. Uh, spell resistance. He can gain immunity to burning. Uh, fog, foggers. Fog engulfs the entire battlefield for one turn. For the duration, every tile is shrouded and ranged attacks do half damage. The whole battlefield. Elemental fog. Fog barrier. Uh, fog walker. The hero ignores fog's weapon damage reduction. Oh, so it affects friendly fire. The fog walker. Uh, persistent fog, duration increased by one turn. Spell power, range of spells increased, damage increased. Mindstorm, if at least three skills run cooldown, casting a skill reduces all currently running cooldowns by one turn. Uh, Pyromania, plus 50% to burning damage. Oh my god. Okay, so it's I'm probably gonna go for Pyromania first, because I'm this number one source of his damage is burning. And then maybe Master of Fire after that. Uh, those look awesome. Those look definitely some things to look forward to there, friends. Mm-mm-mm-mm-mm. Uh, yeah. Jeez. Okay. I know we got some uh, some relics and stuff. What do we get? Plus five damage against burning units. Plus five against stunned. Versus two turn additional burning. Probably the duration. The, du the duration is huge. 
How much does it... Yeah, because it does burning for one turn. This makes it three. So this weapon effectively triples the burning damage. It's kind of a big deal, guys. It's kind of a big deal. Alright, armor... His armor's pretty good. Gain an armor after each fight if you didn't take any damage. By the end of the last mission, he had like six armor saved up. Ring... What is this? Grant's Master Spell. Which of these things are an artifact? Again, I hate that these are make are right there. I hate that those are all mixed up. Plus four burning damage. Oh! Oh boy, yes. Fire, fire, and more fire for Merlin. Thank you. Yes, 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 yes. Wait, there's a plus two burn damage and duration here. Wait a minute, can Merlin use that? Oh my god, Chad, it just keeps getting better. Plus two burning duration. So now his one turn burning is going to last like four turns. And it's going to do way more damage. His basic attack is going to be like the hardest hitting thing in my repertoire. That's insane. All right. Those are done. Those are done. Those are done. All right. What do we do? We got a little bit of money. What do we do with it? Um, I could... Get the last slot of the training ground. Have more people leveling up passively. That's definitely an option. Uh, server so vitality. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. What about the enchanted tower? Oh, there's new stuff here. I should look at this. Uh, 50% of damage suffered gained as bonus damage until the next attack. Oh, that's such a brawler item. First attack every turn does guaranteed max hit. Uh, heavy armor gains plus two armor for each AP reserve for one turn. Plus 5% damage until the end of the encounter for each hit received. Plus two unbreakable armor when outnumbered. That's pretty good. Uh, Conjurer's Ice Gem. Plus three damage against the Sealy. I think those are like fairies. Minus one cooldown for ice skills. I plus four damage against chilled targets. I don't really have anybody using a lot of ice skills. Slayer's Oath. Plus three. Regain three armor for each kill. Regain three armor for each kill. That would be pretty wild. Uh, gain one AP for the first kill each turn. Regain five hit points for each kill. That's a big maybe. Like the tank, if so, it's like if you let the tank last hit things, he recovers his ability to tank really quickly. Rune of the Winged Axe: the first melee attack costs zero AP each turn. Gain five damage for one turn after using a movement skill, plus three poison damage. Okay, this would be really solid for our boy Tristan. Uh, all right. Lose 10% block, but gain the ability to regain armor and HP faster. If he last hits. Tristan's weapon is 7 to 14. Dude, Tristan's weapon does 7 to 14, and this one is just 15. Just period. So he would be doing more damage than his old max with his knives. And you get... Uh, and plus five damage after using a movement skill. I think his leap is a movement skill. I think I'm going to get this. This is my first time uh, getting something from the Mage Tower. Steam Achievement. A powerful trinket. Purchase a relic item. Yep, that is the first time I did um, okay, so weapon, show me, sort, and there's that. There we go. Uh, now he uses the same type of weapon that, uh, Mordred does. Seven to 
14. That's minus 2 to the minimum, plus 5 to the maximum. 9 to 16. Alright, we'll give him that. Uh, let's see. What's the name of the game? This game? This is King Arthur Knight's Tale. It's, um... I've said this many times, but it's it's a turn-based RPG, kind of, uh, it plays kind of like XCOM, but with a fantasy setting, and um, there is uh, some kind of like Divinity Original Sin in there, too. So, she finished getting her injury treated, now she is uh, healing, he's getting his injury treated. One, two, three, four, my favorite four are ready to go. Do I do this? I don't really desire either of these, I don't think. Yeah, his ice shield thing was interesting. Yeah, yeah I didn't really love him. Uh, Bedivere would be like an alternative for Tristan, but he doesn't have leap, so it's kind of whatever. Uh, Lady Guinevere, she's weird. I didn't like her kit. And Tager is another Tristan swap out. More relics for Greedy Merlin. I don't think so. Like, I don't have a relic staff. He's got relic armor already. Relic accessory. I have one relic accessory, but his is so much better for what I'm using him for. All right, do I have potions for everyone? Yes, I do. All right, so I don't really have anything for Kay to do unless I upgrade the training ground again, which I could totally do. Let's do it. All right, so now I can have four people getting XP while I go on a mission. Uh, a matter of faith. Making justice in the matters of faith is the most futile and ungrateful task for a king. This time, I couldn't avoid it. My vassals almost ambushed me about the burial rituals used in Camelot. As a practical man, I don't think that this would be our most urgent dilemma right now, but it would be a mistake to dismiss my knights as some of them are dreaming about eternal life and a forgiving god or gods. Uh, wow. So, either make all the Christians mad, make all the old faith mad, or just say, you can all do what you want. I'm just gonna say y'all can do what you want. <laughs> I don't really just want to make everybody mad. Refugees from the north. The scouts have returned interesting news. A battered barge washed up in the Whispering Cove with a few survivors. They risked the otherworldly sea to escape the marauding Picts, who raised several towns and villages in the northern region of Av Avalon. I don't know these people, and the last thing I need is potential trouble. But these sad refugees looked useful at least. Most of them are skilled craftsmen with families, and they are clearly not in the position to be choosy about a new master. Offer minimal food and minimal payment. You trade 400 gold for building resources. Offer a fair wage. 800 gold for building resources and its right. Choose only the useful ones and get rid of the others. <laughs> Every rightful and neutral hero will hate you. Gain to it. Yeah, we're not doing that. Uh, I'm very low on building resources. I will offer a fair wage and get a rightful point. <laughs> You can stay, but your grandma, she's got to go. Sorry. Yeah, your kids too. Uh, into the deep wood. This is another long mission. Okay. All right. Chat, I am going to save it there because I am starving.